The New York Giants took Saquon Barkley with the second overall pick in this year's NFL draft. Now, whether or not you agree with that move from a football standpoint, passing over a quarterback there, you can't deny the fact that Saquon Barkley has the potential to be a fantasy football monster. He's going to be the three-down playmaker out of the backfield for the Giants, something they've looked for for a long time. He's also going to be another one of their receivers. In his junior season at Penn State last year, he caught 54 passes for 632 yards and three touchdowns. Now, something the Giants haven't had in a long time is a good offensive line. They've been absolutely terrible, but the Giants have taken steps this offseason to make that line at least a little bit better, signing tackled Nate Solder from New England and uh, drafting Will Hernandez, a guard, in the second round. So I think that line is at, at least de decent, at least middle of the pack, and Saquon Barkley uh, has showed in college at least that he could do a lot more with a lot less, not having the best offensive line at Penn State. So the Giants really have a... Uh, dynamic offense now that features a three-down threat in Saquon Barkley, Odell Beckham Jr., one of the best off, one of the best wide receivers in football, uh, Sterling Shepard, Evan Ingram. The Giants are going to score a lot of points and put up a lot of yards, and Saquon Barkley is going to be a huge recipient of that. I'm taking Saquon Barkley in redraft leagues towards the end of the first round. There are not very many running backs that I would put ahead of Saquon right now.